Celebration reading for all Sun, Moon, and Rising Geminis. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. It is the 40th week of the year 2017, and the week begins with the energy vibration from um, an uh, hurt energy, um, the air vent, and we are working with the the hair. So this is going to be a week where you need to transformation in your own life so you are going to be healing yourself i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back I welcome all newcomers and thanks to all my subscribers um this is going to be a week of transformation for you guys you have the energy of the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are coming true so this is a wonderful energies for you guys the energy of the nine of cups is always um when we are trying to transform a whole lot of things in our lives and this is going to be happening i'm sorry but there is so many reverse cards for you guys which is unbelievable um i haven't seen so much reverse cards in a very long time it's going to be a very feminine week for you guys whatever is happening the energy vibration your feminine side is going to be coming up in this week so let's go forward and see what else is happening for it Gemini's in the 40th week of the year 2017 let's see what is happening for you Gemini's you women are going to have to be looking for your inner light and strength okay so as we look at the energy on Monday, we have a fire energy. This fire energy is the nine of um, ones. The nine of ones is uh, um, you're ready for anything that is coming at you. You are ready to open up and connect. There is a really going to be a transformation that is coming in. So be aware of this. So whatever is happening in your life and in your world, know that there is going to be a positive transformation that will be happening as you look within and find that inner strength to move forward. And you are being protected, but yet still you are protecting yourself and awaken to whatever is coming up because there is going to be a huge transformation always call in the angels and guides as you feel as if um, there is low energies and that sort of a thing call upon the angels and guides as we move forward we are having the energy vibration of um, the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse forms, which is uh, um, weird, the, the King of Pentacles in the reverse form. And uh, whoever this person is, they no longer have an effect on you. Okay, the King of Pentacles is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person who no longer have an effect on you. And this is going to be a huge celebration because you're going to be overcoming something that you have been dealing with for a very long time. So there is going to be a positive huge celebration coming in, and you're going to be realizing that you have overcome a situation in your life, and this is going to be good so look out for what is happening in the middle of the week you have an um, urge um, this is pentacles so no this is the ones the ten of ones whatever your burden was it is no longer there it is in the reverse forms so whatever you were burdensome with whatever um, that was pulling you down is now in the reverse form you have finally got it under control you Gemini so whatever it was you have finally got it on the control and you're realizing that you have overcome a situation that has been very burdened to you you have it under control and everything is going to it's as if you have uh, your foot over your enemies and uh, you have them underneath your foot and this is going to be very very positive for you Gemini so, as we move forward we have the energy vibration on Thursday of the energy of a water energy the angman you'll be looking within to find your true inner light you'll be trying to find out what is happening to you and you are going to be victorious over whatever the situation is okay so this victory is because of your intellectual you're going to overcome a situation in your life whatever has been happening you have healed the situation and you want to Move, move on and this is very good so on Thursday it's going to be very positive for you Gemini's because with your intellect you're you're healing a situation in your life and this is going to be positive 
as we move forward on Friday um, you have uh, the energy vibration of uh, um, the sword the six of swords so you have ended a journey you have come out of a journey whatever a situation that was um, taking place in your life for sometimes you have ended this journey and you are moving away and you have the four of sword you finally now have rest in your life you finally now you can rest you can walk away from something and find inner peace in your life and this is good as we look at Saturday, we have um, you standing upright, which is good. You are using your um, intellectual and um, to um, remove a burdensome situation, which was very good because um, um, this comes up. So you have the, the the ten, the number ten energy twice, which is extremely good. So number ten. Is going to be playing a significant role new beginnings the end of burden some things and a new beginning for you so it's as if you're you are setting something um, that went wrong right for you so this is going to be um, positive on Sunday you have the energy of the seven of Pentacles um, this is a situation that you have been working on and you are going to be receiving gifts you're either be sending out or receiving gifts okay so um, the seven of Pentacles is as if you've worked on something for a very hard time a very long time and now you're finally finally receiving um, the awards receiving gifts from your hard work it's as it's as if it's a celebration of you finally um, seeing what you have been given out is coming back to you in temple and this is going to be positive so some people will be receiving and some people will be given it's an exchange of your energy vibration and by uh, giving and receiving uh, you will see positive energies coming up in your life the number 10 again is going to be your energy vibration for for this um, um, this week number 10 is a positive energy whatever that you are having with a Taurus Virgo or um, a Capricorn um, um, person um, that is over the, the ages of 45 um, this is going to be yield and um, on Friday is a good day to rest on Friday whatever is going on is a good day to rest whatever that you were wishing and dreaming for is going to happen for you and this is going to be a positive week um, it's not a week of love it's a week of healing um, something that you have done wrong um, it's now been healed and um, you are yielding but yet still healing and releasing so it's a week of transformation by you healing and releasing something in your life the overcoupling of your week as the beginning of the week you have the king you have to deal with someone who is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn and in the past there was a situation that you weren't protecting yourself and um, there was a, a, a changes that come in so a transformation and now there is the energy vibration of uh, um, someone, um, you people uh, between the ages of uh, um, um, 18 and 35, and whatever the burden was, you're now releasing yourself from the burden. Second half of the week is that you, um, you're you looking for um, energy, a, a new vibration of energy. You're, you've lost your, your, your energy, you've lost you're in a light and uh, now you are going to use the the uh, by giving and receiving you're going to do something good to heal a situation that you have uh, um, done unbalance and by doing that then you are going to reach a place in your life where you come to rest you have forgive yourself forgive the people around you and you have come to rest but it's something that you Gemini did to someone and uh, you realize that you have done something wrong and um, now the healing is coming forward and coming out so it's a it, it's, it's really a week of healing for you guys and releasing your burdens and that sort of a thing um, 
the, the, the energies of love is um, not really in this week you you are just removing yourself from certain aspects and certain things and you are having forgiveness and moving onward so this is good um we are using um these cards which is wonderful the um, message from the abundant universe let's see what you Gemini's have I don't know why these cards are in the upside and down oh uh, if it was just let me read it like this if it was just about surviving getting by and keeping things the way they are then how would you explain your wild imagination if it was just about sacrifice self-sacrifice and illumination how would you best serve this and if it was just about thinking reflecting and spiraling stuff then how would you explain the physical world get the picture want it all that's what it's there for this is wonderful so you have received the color of orange um, call upon Archangel Metatron to say I now invoke Archangel Metatron to put the uh, your um, coat of your orange coat around me and to bring in um, the Christ light and positive energies so call upon Archangel um, Metatron to heal and remove and place the orange coat of protection ask him to place the orange energy the orange ray to flow through you and surround you okay it's orange so it's good I love orange okay so I want to say to each and every person um, know that whatever you send out is whatever you receive um, whatever healing you're doing it's positive please like share these videos thumbs up and I'm saying namaste until next time listen to your Sun Moon and Rising sign this is very important yeah.